we're really good to talk to you. So many good ideas oh, yeah. about the game too, like how to learn and get better and stuff. It's really neat. And of course, COBOL is um, sweet, fun. I don't, I don't know. I don't out know. of game? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah he's a you really don't think, nice you don't guy. think so in game? Uh, I, I, no. have, I have fun playing against him. In game? Oh, yeah, he's tons of fun to fight, but yeah, he's yeah. definitely a bit of a bully. Oh, well, yeah, that's yeah, the style. Yeah. That's the style for sure, yeah. Uh, but I think in, in general, Collins, uh, I don't know, he's very, very good at this matchup in particular. Like, I feel like uh, his best matchups, probably like Falcon first, obviously. Everyone knows him for how good he is versus Falcon. Yeah. But uh, after that, he's phenomenal versus, like, the mid. Like, he had to beat the Swooper to get here. Yep. Like, uh, random mid-tier matchups that you think your local Fox player might lose Pretty good to. Pretty versus Ices, He excels too, right? versus Ices. He's yeah. amazing versus Ices. Yeah, yeah. He's amazing versus Luigi and, like, all those characters. But I think another character he's really, really good versus is Sheik. Yeah. Well, uh, I mean, way back in, like, I remember when I started, like, the 2009, 2010 VODs, him versus Mewtwo King. There were some close ooh, ones. Yeah. There were some close ones in yeah. uh, MTK's first picking up Sheik. But we have oh. Draft in here bringing out the chain right away. How much percent? It did 42. Almost 40 damage. Yo, that combo is off the chain. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll leave. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. I didn't think about it before Honestly, I said it. it. It was impressive. I somehow <laughs> didn't even think of it. Oh. All right, Draft gets the first stock. All thanks to the chain, to be honest. I, mean, I feel like that was, that, was a, that was a tone setter. You know, all Sheik's asked the question, how do I get Fox out of crouch cancel percent for some of my stuff? One yeah. answer is you wiggle the electric chain around. Draffin's not on Metify. They got to get him on there. He could really enlighten people with that. <laughs> Draffin on Metify would be so funny. Oh, yeah. I would love to watch Draffin VOD review with, like, Newer yeah, players yeah he, and needs, stuff. he needs a Patreon like Drug Fox where like all of the VODs from like all the lessons are there, so you can just get po infinite pools of Dreff and Wisdom. He, yeah, he is. He definitely has a lot of personality when he talks. It'd be so fun. Yeah. Uh, we do have an even game, however, as Cobalt's able to bring it back. That yeah, stock. cleans up the stock. I like the Shine reversal. I guess it was uh, Shield Drop Shine. Yeah. Even faster than Shine out of Shield. Oh, I'm surprised Dreffin got away there. That was crazy. I've seen a lot of foxes going for like up throw up air versus Sheik too recently. I think part of the reason just is like if they get out of it, at least you're not getting hit. Yeah, and you you can keep sharking after. Yeah, and yeah. Uh, the the actual I mean, if you hit the up air, like it's so juicy. Yeah, exactly. Keep, keeping Sheik above you, Sheik's like probably one of the easiest characters to shark due to her bad drift and like uh, she doesn't have good aerials coming down at all. What you gonna do, down area? Yeah, down air <laughs> is like basically not even a down move. <laughs> no, that's true. It like yeah. hits more inside yeah, of her. Yeah, yeah. She like. She has long limbs, but surprisingly, a couple of her moves have terrible hitboxes. Mm -hmm. That one, the dash attack's super bad too, right? Like it's the like dash attack is really in, weird. It's in her body she, only. She, so the, the the good thing about dash attack is the way she propels herself forward, not, yes, not actually yes. the hitbox so much. Yeah, true. Because it, it goes far. That's why her boost grab is so huge too. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this is kind of a oh, Draven just goes for a fair there. That's crazy. I feel like most cheeks would just jump needle and then, but I mean, he's Draven. He's got this. A lot of full hop aerials from Cobalt while Dreffin's on the platform. So Dreffin does find his way down. Needle's not able to catch angle. him. Yeah. Very nice. Backer. Oh, I'm surprised he messed that up. But I feel like the timing was actually pretty tight there. He kind of got up from the ledge a little late. That Ooh. fair felt like a big reversal to me. Oh, yeah. It gets that could have been, been a big <laughs> deal. I feel like uh, forward throw is kind of weird, but. Does that kill? kill? <laughs> we ask at the same time because we both don't think it does. Yeah, it's definitely Dreamland, uh, and he's still stage level, so. Oh! Oh, that was tricky. He almost made it back. Colin did not even care. Well, yeah, because there's nothing. There's no way he could end I mean, up on stage from that yeah, spot, There's right? nothing to be afraid of, but most people would be like, oh, we got pineapple. May maybe they'd get up. They'd roll knows? up or something, yeah. Colin was like, nah, I'm here until that she's gone. It's like uh, that thing they say about Jerry Rice, how he would always run all the way to the end zone in yeah. practice. Never pop off <laughs> too early. Let's oh, go. he shines it. That That's Cobalt stuff, knowing that it's like vulnerable so long and he's able yeah. to shine it like on reaction. It's like a prediction confirmation. Yeah, he's yeah. up there and he's going to do the shine. And then if the poof's about to happen, he can either go to ledge or stage. Mm -hmm. He's really good at, um, I think because his decision making so quick, he's good at putting himself, wow, 30 this time. He's really Dude. good at putting himself in a position that lets his decision making shine. Yeah. Like, because he could do like one of like several things right from that same spot. Oh, he calls it out this time. Yeah. 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 Colin's gone away with that one too many times. I mean, Dreffin had a strong stock in the first game too. We'll see if he can keep it going the whole time. And yeah, uh, he opened that's... it with the the solid 30 chain this time. Not not 42, but still very respectable. Guess I'm right out of crouch cancel percent. So. Wow, somehow oh. gets away with a side beam. 
Nair just barely catching him. Yeah, Dreffen trying to control so, airspace with Nair, I'm I guess. I'm surprised he went for the up air there. I feel like... Back air nice. or something? Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah back air. But I, I was curious what he's going to do now. Oh, he hits the top of it again. Yeah, you're, it's not all invincible. Yeah. In fact, not that much of it is invincible. Kona has a really good back. feel for punishing those types of moves. Mm -hmm. So, like you were saying earlier. Oh, Ooh, jumps up and catches out. him. Back air. Oh, oh, oh. oh. If, he, if he fast fell that and did it like faster, maybe it would have worked. That would have been insane. Oh, great needle. Kind of gets a little messed up on the platform, but doesn't matter. He gets the forward tilt. Yeah, Let's keep go. It simple. I think if you perfect speed spot as Fox, you probably dodge it. Yeah. Uh, Dreffin got stuck on the platform with his needles, but he, yeah. was he was trying to cover the ride the wall angle with him. Uh, but it didn't matter in the end because Colin went up. Okay, goes for the second up air. Still a cheek above nice you, so it's a yeah. good spot. That's the thing about... Yeah, see, she just comes down with down air. It's so useless. Yeah, you just kind of wait for her to miss. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Completely even again. <laughs> Traffic oh. Traffic comes down oh the visibility, the come down, stand there. Stand there and jab. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think that that's pretty good versus certain Fox when they're really moving and you're invincible to try to run through you. So maybe he's trying to like predict that and look for like jab grab or something. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's that's my guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, I mean, I feel like that's a really common mix up on uh, your opponent's invincible. So you just try to like cross them up so that maybe they'll try to dash to the direction you were in previously. Yeah, yeah. Or maybe they try to follow you and you mix them again or something. I mean, and a lot of times the mix up isn't that you're doing that. It's like how long you take before you do that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. that shine to wave dash grab is. Yeah, he's moving fast now. He's moving fast and he had the. Uh, the wherewithal to like when he shined him and he was in the air he didn't try to immediately commit and maybe get shield grabbed or something because once when you get shined in the air you immediately land and can act as opposed to getting the grounded shine what i think is crazy is when they were in the corner over there cobalt did like shine and he waited in it for a minute if i was dreffin i definitely would have grabbed but that wouldn't have worked because cobalt full hops so they were both like super aware of the situation yeah it's kind of this is a very quirky match i'll say that yeah they're both very unique not many players like Colin. Definitely not many players like Dreffen. No. Ooh. no. Let's go. No. Up smash does it. Yeah, you can't land on the stage. Too yeah. much lag on that up B. I, I, ima I can't imagine he meant to land on stage when ledge was completely open, but Pro probably quite not. unlucky. Maybe he wanted to do the short. You know, you can shorten Yeah, the that shorten. One. That could be. And like go slightly above and I don't know. Depends. Or maybe that was the short. And no, I don't think it was. I was gonna say maybe that was a short, and the mix-up is either platform or shortened the ledge, because that's something Sheik's like to do, right? Yeah, but I feel like uh, ledge was completely open there, so I can't imagine it was anything but a mess-up. Yeah, yeah, it must have been. It's harder when I'm. Mean, it's not that much harder when you're going like up diagonal. I'm gonna say when you're going like. I mean, just certain angles yeah. are easier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good down air, and the immediate back throw, which is kind of crazy. I but feel like most Sheiks would set up for some sort of down throw easily. That is so classic Dreffin. Let's go. Getting the spot dodge to dodge the um, Fox illusion. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah. He, he actually does that all the time. He That's spot sick. dodges and runs in and punishes. Oh, I mean, it's not like it would have killed if it's sweet spot anyway. Honestly, it might be better. Oh, oh, it's a back throw. What a good spot. Oh, <laughs> Colin does not go straight that in. That up smash oh. made no sense. He could react to it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> That was crazy. <laughs> He's like trying to will it into existence. Yeah, he definitely tried to will a Tim Rouse smash into existence with both of them. He was like, please, <laughs> please. Okay, it's completely even now. When uh, I feel like Dreffin had a pretty prime spot there. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I mean, still in a good spot. Out of crouch, cancel the shent, and now he just comboed him to 90. Ooh. Yeah, the wrong way. Kind of cringe that that side be hit. <laughs> he was just standing on stage. I got to say, you're probably right. Yeah. Oh, now that, yeah, Shine pushes him farther off. The second shine, really clever, actually, so that you can get your yeah. um, invincibility from the ledge later. And then that time waits him out coming back on stage. A good trade. Nice. Cobalt able to take the stock first. And what I think is a really impressive edge guarding sequence. Lots of ingenuity. Lots of just like being patient and trying to wait for Dreffen because Sheik's only mix ups while off stage are really her double jump and like when she does her up B timing. So mm -hmm. if you're patient and you like react when you see the double jump or the up B, like with uh, when Colin can like shine it and stuff, you know? And in the in the nice. moments you were talking about that, Cobalt put on 77%. Yeah, and that was, was a big lead in this stock. There's two up smashes, too, in there. Didn't even feel like it was from a huge combo. He just kind of kept the opening and then uh, yeah. sort of just pushed him from side to side. Nice. Oh, is he dead? 
That oh was, it my was, god, he is dead, but wow. that's not how I thought that would play yeah, out. Yeah, it, it was nice smash DI on the drill and yeah. everything, but he couldn't get to the ledge, and instead Cobalt was able to finish it. I mean, very impressive, I, Colin. I thought Dreffit looked impressive, and he got 3 0'd. Yeah, right? yeah, that was <laughs> so. not, for, for a 3 0, that was not a bad set at all. I feel like Dreffit really had some chances there. Uh, just a few flubs, and he, he didn't, like, drop that much, to be honest. No. He, he was punishing really no. hard. It was just, uh, Colin definitely hit some pretty crazy stuff. And I feel like sometimes in the pivotal moments, like, he'd get the back throw, and then not only would it not, I, like, I don't always expect a gimp, because that's a mix-up or whatever, yeah. but then also, like, just kind of lost, lost grasp of it. Oh, we have a fresh cut moment replay for this set coming up? Oh, nice. I mean, Colin had a lot of hype stuff, so let's see where it goes. Also, shout outs to Fresh Cut. Oh, the back air. Yeah, oh, this is the end of the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. see yeah. that smash that down on that drill, drill? And then he comes down and gets the shine. If you want to see more awesome moments like that from Smash World Tour, Fresh Cut is the place to go. Yes, sir. Um, and there's been, we've had quite a few good clips because there are a lot of there stylish players. There have been so players. many good sets yep. and uh, replays from both streams, too. So basically, if, yep. if anything sick happened in the all the pools that happened before now, or in round two bracket. It's on Fresh Cut. It's probably yeah. on Fresh Cut. It's on Fresh Cut for sure. I wonder if there are uh, any recording setups out there. That would be cool, too. Probably not. But I mean, that, that's, that's, that's always, that's, there's that's always one or two out school. there. You know? That's old school. There's 